1970s Lincoln sent with large date and double die obverse. Graded in mint state 64 red by NGC. According to Heritage Auctions, at one point this variety was thought to be just as rare as the 1969s double die, although today's certified population figures suggest it is marginally more plentiful, albeit still scarce in any grade. Strong doubling is most prominent throughout in God We Trust and Liberty, but is also visible on the date. It was sold for $1,860 on December 17, 2023. Number 7. 1930s Lincoln Cent. Graded in Mint State 67 Red by NGC. According to Heritage Auctions, this is a sharply struck, pristine copper red example of the 1930s Lincoln Cent, showing no carbon spotting or bothersome abrasions. I appeal is excellent. This issue is rare in MS67 Red, and no numerically finer red coins are known, as of December, 2023. It ended up selling for $2,640. Number 6. 1910 Lincoln Cent. Sharply and richly colored proof penny. Graded as PR66 plus red by NGC. Broad, squared rims and fine matte surface texture leave no doubt as to this coin's proof origins. Each side displays deep pumpkin orange color and is devoid of bothersome abrasions. A loop reveals a few tiny specks on each side, particularly on the reverse. It was sold for $2,760. Number 5. 1921 Lincoln Cent. Graded in Mint State 67 Red by NGC. This Philadelphia issue is among the more plentiful early dates in the Lincoln Cent series, although full red specimens are conditionally rare at the superb gem level. This piece is tied with one other for finest at NGC. Central strike sharpness is outstanding, while only slight weakness is seen around the rims due to dye fatigue. Satiny copper gold and orange hues adorn each side. It was sold for $3,120. Number 4. 1909 SVDB Cent. Graded in Mint State 66 Brown by NGC. The 1909 SVDB Lincoln Cent is widely sought in red or red and brown grades, although such coins bring collectors a plethora of quality trade-offs, including often carbon spots, insufficient red color, or artificially brightened surfaces. High-end brown examples are distinctly underappreciated. This premium gem glistens with satiny mint luster bathed in chestnut brown, violet, and honey gold colors. A few microscopic pepper specks are well hidden by the patina. It was sold for $4,920. Number 3. 1914 D. Lincoln Cent. Graded in Mint State 67 Red and Brown by PCGS. Moderate copper red luster still clings to the protected portions of this near gem 1914 D. Lincoln Cent. The design elements exhibit bold definition, and the overall eye appeal is pleasing. Much of each side displays reddish-brown toning. A few tiny specks are not bothersome. It was sold for $4,320. Number 2. 1945 Lincoln sent in MS67 plus red condition. According to Heritage Auctions, remarkably, the Philadelphia issue of this year is scarcer in high grade than either of the branch mint dates. This plus-designated superb gem is among the finest at PCGS, an important acquisition for the competitive registry set collector. The surfaces are vibrantly lustrous, with lilac and olive hues emerging from the coppery red patina. The strike is sharp and just a single, tiny carbon speck is detected, in the field behind Lincoln's shoulder. It ended up selling for $20,400. Number 1. 1922 No D. Lincoln sent with strong reverse. Graded in Mint State 64 Brown by PCGS. Die pair 2. The second 2 in the date is sharp on this die pair, and the reverse wheat ears are crisp, a product of a new die. The no D coins from die pair 2 are highly sought after and rare in high grade. This satiny walnut brown example displays modest luster and is well struck. Softness on Lincoln's portrait is due to the erosion of the obverse die. This is one of the most prominent guide book varieties in the series. It is often collected as a separated issue from the normal mint mark issue, even though both varieties were struck at Denver. This specimen fetched a sum of $31,200. There you have it guys. If you like the video smash that thumbs up and subscribe buttons below. Until next time, happy hunting, and may your pockets be filled with treasures. Bye.